De Amerikaanse ambassadeur Karen Lynn Williams heeft bij de viering van de Amerikaanse Onafhankelijkheidsdag gesteld dat Suriname voorbeeldig is voor de wijze waarop zij de beleving van de democratie in staat houdt. De diplomaat wees erop dat er dus een goede verstandhouding moet zijn tussen de verschillende landen om de waarborging van de democratie wereldwijd te versterken. What the past few years have shown us is that we are a global family. We are interconnected and interdependent. Our continued independence, our continued growth and prosperity and safety is only assured through our alliances and partnerships with neighbors and friends who share our fundamental values, which is why we so deeply, the U.S. so deeply values this U.S.-Suriname relationship. Working together, we are promoting entrepreneurship, supporting young Surinamese who want to start businesses, and women business owners in the country's rural regions. As a team, we are combating international criminal organizations through training, workshops, and partnership with the DEA, the FBI, and the Justice Department, leading to increased safety for us all and a stronger rule of law. Working side by side, we are exploring ways to modernize vocational education to provide a workforce that employers need while deepening institutional ties between Suriname and universities and colleges in the U.S. Williams zegt verder dat er nu gewerkt wordt aan de versterking van het Amerikaanse militair apparaat. De kennisuitwisseling met het Surinaamse leger zal hierna ook vervolgd worden. De afgelopen jaren zijn deze projecten regelmatig uitgevoerd. We are supporting efforts to counter corruption and end money laundering. We are developing young civic leaders through alumni workshops, led workshops and NGO organized sessions to develop Suriname's human capital for the future. And we are finding ways to work to protect our uh, planet and ensure Suriname remains a renowned ecological wonder with exchanges of information and expertise such as a regional uh, exchange program this July focused on providing insight into alternate energy production and ways to mitigate the impact of climate change. We stood by Suriname throughout the pandemic with medical supplies and protective equipment, vaccines, and a field hospital. Through our partners at UNDP, UNICEF, PAHO, and SEDEMA, the U.S. has provided funding via USAID to assess flooding damage and to support medical programs in the interior. Williams verklapte tijdens haar toespraak ook dat er een bijkantoor van het Agentschap voor Internationale Ontwikkeling, USAID, geopend zal worden. Het doel hiervan is de samenwerking tussen Suriname en de Amerikaanse ambassade op te graden.